five-year-old girl and seven-year-old boy playing on an Englewood street were shot in their legs late Monday night, the two among more than 40 wounded in shootings over the holiday weekend. The two were in the 5500 block of South Hermitage about 11 p.m. when at least one person started shooting, hitting the two children. The younger was first taken to St. Bernard Hospital and Healthcare Center by family members before being transferred to Cumber Children's Hospital. The older was taken to Cumber Children's Hospital by paramedics. Police lay markers next to shell casings in the middle of Hermitage and more markers next to a separate location of shell casings further north in the block, on the sidewalk. Officers taped off Hermitage from Garfield Boulevard to 56th Street as officers scan the street for evidence. Family members gathered at Cummer Children's Hospital, where both kids were taken. Relatives said the kids were outside playing with fireworks when at least one person started shooting, though there was at least one other person with the shooter. They had emerged from a gangway looking suspicious, relatives said, and the shooting started not long after that. Though police said the boy was seven, relatives said he was eight. The girl and the boy, who are cousins, were playing outside in a group of children when someone came out of a gangway and fired shots, according to family. Dozens of people were on the block, and people scattered. The girl was the first one the family realized was shot. Her cousin, Daryl Smith, drove her to Cumber Children's Hospital. I literally ran through every red light, he said as he stood outside Cummer's early Tuesday morning. A couple of minutes later, relatives realized that the eight-year-old was also shot. An ambulance took him to the hospital. Both children were shot in the leg. The boy was in surgery because his ankle broke as a result of his injury. The attacks raised the number of people shot in the city over the 4th of July weekend to at least 43, according to data collected by the Tribune. Among those, three people were fatally shot over the weekend holiday. A fourth person killed was stabbed in a domestic-related incident, police said. In other shootings, a man in his 30s was killed Monday night in the 6900 block of South Clyde Avenue in the South Shore neighborhood. Police responded to a traffic crash and found him in the street, shot in the abdomen. The man was taken to Strauger Hospital in critical condition, police said, but later pronounced dead. That happened about 9.20 p.m. about the same time, two men were shot in the 5700 block of South May Street, police said. A 24-year-old man was shot in left hand back and right leg and taken to Strauger Hospital and a 37-year-old man wounded in the same incident was taken to St. Bernard Hospital in good condition. He had a leg wound. Someone on foot fired shots toward them, hitting them both. A 24-year-old man was left in critical condition with a chest wound from a shooting in the 1800 block of West Erie Street about 9 p.m., police said. He was at a party when someone on a bike fired toward the man, hitting him in the chest. About 8.30 p.m., someone shot a 29-year-old man in the leg in the 7200 block of South Artesian Avenue. He was outside in a crowd when someone walked up and shot him in the leg. He's in good condition at Advocate Christ Medical Center. About 7.15 p.m. a 32-year-old man shot shot on the 1700 block of North Mozart Street in the Logan Square neighborhood, police said. The man was walking when he was shot in the left knee, police said. The man, who is a gang member, was taken to Stronger Hospital, where his condition stabilized, police said. At 2.15 p.m., a person was shot on the 1500 block of West Garfield Boulevard in the back of the Yards neighborhood, said Officer Thomas Sweeney, a police spokesman. A 17-year-old was in a vehicle that was stopped when another vehicle pulled up and shots were fired, hitting the teen in the shoulder, Sweeney said. The teen was taken to St. Bernard Hospital, where his condition had stabilized. At 1.25 p.m., a 33-year-old man was shot on the 9,800 block of South Ingleside Avenue in the Cottage Grove Heights neighborhood on the south side, Sweeney said. 
the man was shot in the buttocks and leg and was taken to Advocate Christ Medical Center, where his condition was stabilized. The man was on the street when a van pulled up and people exited and began firing. Around 12.15 p.m. in the Princeton Park neighborhood on the southeast side, a 27-year-old man was shot on the 200 block of West 95th Street, Sweeney said. The man was shot in the legs and was taken to Little Company of Mary Hospital in good condition, Sweeney said.